one of them mornings again where we need to go get stuff. So we're going to get out of here and uh, head south. I'm Johnny Garage Johnson, and this is Hardcore Garage. One of the coolest things about the internet is you can post about something you'd like to have or what your dreams might be, and occasionally people will hit you up and be like, hey, I got one of them. Come get it. So that's what we did. Let me show you what's up. Uh, always take the country road. Try to stay in your lane though. find it here but we had to go to Kentucky to find it today it's all good I just saw something up here that I needed to go turn around to come back and see again oh looky oh looky oh looky Sonoma GT, or at least wants to be. It's got the uh, train tracks running here beside us that run right to the middle of town. Steve Jessup, I know my rights. I thought that was a real flag there for a minute. It was digital. Hopefully they have some kind of train festival in this town with all the train tracks. It seems to be a significant part of the community.
the train tracks where they cross the road, so they don't use them. <laughs> Obviously. Mm, had to stop and get some Sonic since we're out rolling around. The price is up there. <laughs> we drive four hours for maybe a little bit farther than four hours if you're paying attention in the video you might have saw a little clue when we were at uh, Sonic other than that though let's check it out man pretty cool OG part It is a slim line. I think that's what that said in it. Slim line. Slim line tonneau cover of some sort. Been uh, trying to find as many different ones of these as I can over the years. And there is just so many, so many different styles, brands, manufacturers. And they're all pretty, pretty cool, honestly. Um, the different designs. This one here, I'm. I'm almost certain just because it says Chevrolet that had to have been a you know a licensed product and I feel like I have seen pictures like you know and, and, and I went through a couple of mine haven't found any yet but I, I feel like I've seen pictures of these factory on some of the trucks and I'm not saying it's a factory tonneau cover but a dealer add-on or like like the Sun what was it called uh Sun Dancer, if you guys remember that, that weird topper, it wasn't a GM product, but it was licensed to be on their trucks, uh, sold at the dealerships and such, you know, stuff like that. <clears throat> but these are very cool, got the gas shocks, and I'm, I'm actually leaning in here if you hear an echo. <laughs> Locks. Didn't latch that time, did it? There we go. I don't, it, it's actually not bolted on here, I don't know if you... Probably didn't even show you inside, did I? My clamps are laying right there. I've already got it unclamped. I'm going to stick it on uh, the 90 and see how she looks. So what are you going to do with this tonneau? I say, stop asking stupid questions. <laughs> I don't need that kind of negativity in my life. Here we go. Matches pretty well with this truck, don't it? <laughs> I dig it. I dig it. And come right over here and we can push the button lift her up just like a trunk it's almost like having a an avalanche but not whoa that's a big old spider web bear I about walked right into I don't I don't know why but I, I kind of dig it open too <laughs> let's just ride around like that Pretty sweet. Slim line. Wonder if that's uh, related to slim top or slim tug. 
I really would like one of every Tano ever made. I like one of everything for S10s. We need a, ultimately, <laughs> I would love to have an S10 museum. I could be the core what's that? What's that called? Not corator. I don't even know, but I want to be that guy <laughs> that takes care of the S10 museum. I so get me somebody else to do maintenance, like, like, uh, Jay Leno's garage type thing. <laughs> but I just, I just look at them and polish them and love them and pretend they're my own. Anyway, that was our trip for Labor Day. Labor Day. Labor Day, Labor Day. Yeah, yeah. We went into the hills of Kentucky, saw a couple cool S10s. I'm going to add in here the, that green GT, I really wish someone would have been home. I should have, at the very least, checked the, the VIN number to see if it was a real GT. I'm, I think it was, and I don't know, I'm going to start going through some Google Earth and try to maybe get back up there with a wheel dolly and see if we can't buy that thing. <laughs> My wife's going to hate that. <laughs> anyway, y'all take it easy. Enjoy your weekend. Keep on trucking. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Sound like a robot. <laughs>